You will be with your family in the privacy of your mansion, enjoying a drink and some fruits of Jannah, talking with your family, and then you will hear an announcement inviting you to the city center or the downtown or the souk, whatever you want to call it. So you'll all rush, you and your family, and you'll go there and you'll find all of the people of Jinnah are gathered in one place. This is a, a very important announcement. And not only will you be gathered in Jannah, but you will also see that all of the people of Hellfire will also gathered in one place in Hellfire. And in the area separating Jannah and Nar, the angels will bring with them death in the form of a ram. So death will come in a physical form. You will recognize that this is death. Rasulullah says, فَيَشْرَأْ الدُّونَ Everyone will extend their necks up. It's a very exciting moment. And, and it's a surprise. So Rasulullah says, فَيَشْرَبُونَ Meaning they're all paying attention. They're attentive. فَيُوضَعُ بَيْنَ الْجَنَّةِ وَالنَّارِ Death will be brought between heaven and hell. And then the angels will take a knife and they would slaughter death. They would kill death. Meaning death will cease to exist. And then they will make an announcement and they will say, O oh people of paradise, خُلُودٌ فَلَا مَوْتٌ You will live for eternity and there is no more death. وَيَا أَهْلَ النَّارِ خُلُودٌ فَلَا مَوْتٌ And O oh people of hellfire, eternity and there is no death. Rasulullah ﷺ says, If there is any moment of excitement that will cause a person to die because of how happy they are, it would be this moment for the people of Jannah. And if there is a moment of sorrow and despair that would cause a person to die, it would be this moment for the people of Hellfire. This will be the best moment for the people of Jannah and the worst moment for the people of Hell.